Hi friends, good morning to Inglane English Classroom. Today we are with the ninth grade English Unit 1 as per to win its second lesson that is learning the game first part. Dear friends, you remember the first story in the race, don't you? And we enjoyed it. What was it about? It was about the importance of hard work, encouragement and motivation in achieving in achieving one's goal. You watched a race too. Can you bring that uh, race in your mind? Okay, then Yes, we cannot forget the moment that they don't cross the finishing line, can we? Certainly, when we watch a match, we can have such moments or glimpses that we cannot forget. Am I right? Let us watch the video and see what is it.
Okay, yes, <coughs> you see that moment, that is the moment of a great player, Indian cricket. He is a first century in ODI against England, you have watched it, I think, you have watched it, you might have watched it, and here who is the player, you know him, who is that? That is a uh, Sachin Tendulkar, you know. And now he is a legend in cricket. Okay. See, you know, Tarun's mother and Anara are helping him to become an athlete. Now Sachin is a legend in cricket. Like that, is there anyone who motivated him? Let us see it. Please look at the pictures. Who are these? Who are these? Who is there with Sachin? Did he have any role in identifying Sachin's kid? Let's see it. One more picture. See, Sachin is here and he is giving something to someone. Okay. Who is that? What was his role in identifying Sachin's kids? Let us see, this is written by Sachin. Teachers import not just education but also values. Ajdeka Sir taught me to play straight on the field and in life. I shall always remain grateful to him for his immeasurable contribution in my life. His lessons continue to guide me today. Do you know when did he write it? He wrote it on a children's day, 2019, and he is paying, or he was paying his homage to his childhood coach, Tamakhan Ajareke, who had passed at the age of 87 in uh, January 2019. Okay, now you got one. That is. The last picture, that is, as you know, this is Ajdekar sir, and what about the other? Let Sachin say about it. Look at the picture. Listen, this is a book, a main facing page of a book, water page of a book. You can read it, Sachin Tendulkar, playing it m my way. You read this one, autobiography. This is the autobiography of Sachin Tandulkar. What's his name? Can you read? Playing it my way. In it, he says about, you see, for, let us see that, this autobiography, and the book consists of 28 chapters. It was written after he had bidden farewell to the pitch on 16th November 2013. Winning the game, we have to read that part. That is the second chapter of that autobiography. Do you know what is an autobiography? Auto means self, you know. An autobiography means the accounts of one's own life written by himself. 
that is autobiography if it is written by someone else that is biography you know the difference between autobiographies there are many world famous autobiographies you have to uh, uh, look for it and whenever you time you can uh, read it the autobiographies of great persons in the history right now what is there in it he says about uh, them that means that the first year uh, the persons whom we saw in the pictures and then how hard work encouragement and motivation helped him in achieving his goal and again he tells about his efforts to become a good cricketer okay shall we find it out we can read the first part of it and find out all these things ready dears don't forget to read with me okay from a very early age i played tennis ball cricket with my colony friends i loved watching cricket on television and in our games i often tried to emulate the mannerisms of my favorite players sunil gavaskar and the west indian legend bill richards but it wasn't just the batsman that i studied i also loved bowling throughout my career i have actually bowled a lot in the nets i was then studying in the new english school mumbai but my brother ajit knew that compared to the other schools in mumbai shadashram vidya mandir where ramakan ajrekar sir was the cricket coach gave due importance to the game of cricket he ran summer camps too ajit one day took me to the camp to get trained under sir anyone could come for a trial at the camp but then it was up to sir to decide to who to accept i was 11 years old then ajit sir as i referred to him started playing cricket at the age of 11 in 1943 which is the age i was when i went to him for the first time i had never played it in the nets before and felt it somewhat overawed with so many people around when i was asked to bat i was not at all comfortable with the sir watching me so closely i felt to make an impact sir called ajit azid and told him informed him that i was perhaps too young to make the camp and suggested that he should bring me back when i was a little older very nice it is very simple i think you might have got it uh, some more one more passage is there my induction into the mumbai cricket circuit could have ended in failure but for ajit's insistence having seen me play in colony ajit knew it was capable of performing far better than i had done in front of ajrekar sir he explained that i was nervous and asked sir to give me one more opportunity however he suggested that while doing so sir should pretend to go away and then watch from a distance sir agreed before long i was asked to bat again and without sir strained eyes scrutinizing me or so i thought i felt more at ease and soon started to hit the ball well this time sir agreed to let me join the camp i was delighted and i must say it was an opportunity that transformed my life kids okay, yes. now i think it was simple that's why you might have understood it let us see some questions who took such into the summer camp okay you know that is ajit he was there in the first picture with what intention to train him under ajit ekar sir how old was sachin then you know at that time sachin was 11 years old could he impress the coach in the first attempt okay no give reasons to substantiate your answer he was not admitted to the camp first and sachin uh, sachin's brother that is ajit insisted again then only he got a, a chance and he could impress the sir was sachin given admission to the summer camp at last okay certainly at last finally he got an admission 
how you know he could impress in the second opportunity you know all these things now what can be or what title can be give to this part uh, i think we have to read it once again you can read the paragraph silently again and you have to note the important words too right yes okay i think you might have read it again such is what can be the title that was the question that i i said that is a such is induction into the mumbai cricket circuit that can be the title given to it okay shall we attend some more questions in the early age how did sachin play cricket he played tennis ball cricket with his colony friends what did he watch on television he watched cricket and whom did he try to imitate sunil gavaskar and the west indian legend view richard did he study only the batsman no he loved bowling too and he bowled a lot in the nets in his career where was he studying then or which was his first school the new english school mumbai but who told him about or who knew about a good school or better school where cricket was given appropriate importance that was ajit which was that school that was sardasa vidya mandir what is special with that school there was a veteran cricket coach his name what was his name ramakant ajirekas and he ran summer camps to prodigious where did ajit took a take him one day and why did he take him the ajit one day took him to the camp run by ajit ekar sir it was to get trained under sir and what was special with that camp anyone could come there for a trial but it was sir's choice whether to accept or not at that time how old was sachin he was 11 years old and uh, there is a similarity between uh, the like sir and sachin what was that sir too started playing cricket at the age of 11 in 1943 in the beginning coach sachin impressed the coach or impressed sir why no because he had never beaten uh, beaten in the nets before and because there were many people so he felt overawed and moreover sir was watching him closely then what did uh, ajay krishna suggest he suggested that he was too young and he can be taken to camp late okay then what did ajit do ajit urged uh, sir or uh, persisted his urging and he told him about sachin's nervousness and he asked him or insisted sir to give him one more opportunity and at that time ajit put forward another suggestion what was that sir should pretend to go away and then watch from a distance did ajit sir agree certainly agreed and 
Sachin was given one, one more chance. At that time, what did uh, Sachin think? He thought that he was, sir was not watching him, but he was pretending like that. And uh, what was his impact? He started playing well. This time, he agreed to let Sachin in the camp, you know. And how did or how does Sachin comment on this moment? He says that was the opportunity that transformed his life. Okay, yes. Now, let us see the scaffolding questions. Cite instances from the passage that show Sachin's love for cricket. It is missing here. Sorry. Cricket. Even when, even from a very early age, you can see uh, the first paragraph itself, it is there, you can write it yourself. Early age, he started playing tennis and he used to do uh, tennis ball and he used to watch uh, cricket or television and emulate, emulate the mannerisms of world famous uh, cricketers. Okay, now how did Shadha Samvidyamanda differ from other schools in Mumbai? You know, that is the Shadha Samvidyamanda gave appropriate importance to cricket and there was a veteran uh, uh, desperate coach. What was Ajay Krishna's first impression of Sachin? Sachin could be in the impressor first. And he suggested that he could be taken to the camp later. What was the role of Ajitin Sachin's induction to the Mumbai cricket circuit? It was Sachin who took him to uh, the camp and when he failed first, it was on Ajit's insistence, sir agreed to give him one more opportunity. Okay, yes, you can write it yourself and it is given the in the, the answer, sample answers are given the in the notes. You can verify it now. Let us see it in detail. From a very early age, before that let us see the words, then it will be very easy. Emulate means to imitate. Don't you get it, you know that? Mannerism means a group of unconscious habitual behaviors of style. Legend means a person with legend-like qualities. Idihas Lamaya, Idihas that we call in Malayalam. Career means one's occupation of the Yogi Jeevidam, a general course of action in life. Due adjective that is appropriate. Very simple, yes. You can understand very easily. From a very early age, when he was too young, Sachin played tennis ball cricket with his colony friends, I think no doubt there. He loved watching cricket on television and in their games he often tried to imitate, to do as they did, that is simulate or imitate, Danigarika. The mannerisms, the personal ways of uh, speaking or uh, uh, acting something, we usually do like that. We usually emulate the uh, speaking style or the acting of uh, famous uh, film stars and mannerisms of favorite uh, uh, players who were his favorite players Suril Gavaskar and the West Indian legend world famous West Indian cricketer Willie really Chance okay you got it but it wasn't just batsman that I studied he not only studied the batsman but also he studied bowling or the bowlers too. Throughout his career, his life, he, his uh, real life, his cricket life, he had actually bowled a lot in the next. We can see what is bowling in the next or uh, playing in the next, playing cricket in the next. We can see what it. And at that time he was studying in which school? New Indian School, Mumbai. But his brother knew that compared to other schools in Mumbai, Shadasa Vidya Mandir 
gave due importance to the game of cricket. That means that the school gave more importance than other schools in Mumbai. I think no uh, doubt due means appropriate. He ran summer camps too. He uh, organized summer camps for children for cricket. Okay, clear? Now, this is uh, practicing in the nets. This is Sunil Gavaskar and this is Weave Richards. We can watch practicing in the net for some time. Sachin is practicing in the nets before a match. Let us see for watch for a while. Okay friends, I think I will do. You got the idea about it. Now let us move on to the next paragraph. Here trial means trial, a test of suitability of person. You know that. Overawed means here it is an adverb, frightened, paribhandanaya, paribhandanai, impact, powerful effect. You know these things. Now very simple. Ajithu one day took me to the camp to get trained under sir. One day, Ajithu's brother took him to Ajithu sir's camp. What was the uh, method there, mode of our selection there? Anyone could come for a trial, anyone could come and try. But it was sir's choice to accept him or not. At that time, he was 11 years old. Ajithu sir, how did uh, uh, Sachin refer to Ajrekar sir or Ramakant Ajrekar? He referred to him, he addressed him Ajrekar sir or he want to, when he uh, wanted to refer him, mentioned he used the word Ajrekar sir used in that style Ajrekar That is what meant by us, I refer to him. He usually, he would call him like that. Only that, okay. And Ajayka sir, he too started playing cricket at the age of 11 in 1943, which was the same age uh, in which uh, that uh, Sachin went to the camp, okay. Now, before that, he had been batted in the nets, so he was frightened with so many people around, many are looking at him. So he was overawed, frightened. Then uh, when he was asked to bat, he was not at all comfortable. He couldn't do it at ease. Because of many reasons, many people are there watching and sir was watching him closely. So he failed because of those two reasons. He failed to make an impact. Then, in fact, we have learned powerful effect, you know. And then, sir called Ajit and told him that it was perhaps he was too young to make the camp. That's why asked him to take to the camp later when he was a little older. I think it is, it is very simple. And then, let us move on to the last part. Induction means the process of introducing somebody. Okay. Then insistence means an urgent demand or persistence in urging. Nurbandha. Nervous means easily agitated or alarmed or anxious. Ulkhandala. Pretend, you know, to engage in make believe or fail. Apinayikla. Scrutinize to examine something carefully. At ease, free of anxiety, you know that, standard ease, you know that. Delighted, greatly pleased. Transform means to change. Okay. My induction into the Mumbai cricket circuit could have ended in failure. There, there 
since he failed in the first attempt his induction or he may not be uh, get an entrance or an admission to mumbai cricket circuit but ajit insisted but because of our uh, due to ajit's insistence persistent urging having seen it, it didn't happen it didn't happen because of that having seen me play in the colonia ajit had seen sachin playing cricket with his friends so he knew that he was capable of playing far better than he had done in front of ajrekar sir so he explained to sir that sachin was very anxious nervous and asked sir to give him one more chance however he suggested he requested sir that why uh, uh, sachin was playing cricket or playing sir should fail or should act uh, to go away and then watch from a distance sir agreed before long he was asked to bat again then he thought sir was not scrutinizing him or examining him closely and he uh, had gone away he felt more comfortable free of anxiety and started playing well hitting the ball well this time sir agreed to let him join the camp because he succeeded in impressing sir he was very happy very much happy pleasant and he says that was the opportunity that changed his life okay very nice dear yes, very nice i think you got all the things now let us move on to the main ideas the lesson learning the game deals with sachin's introduction to the game of cricket an 11 year old sachin is depicted pictureized you know portrayed in the excerpt excerpt means a part of a, a long or lengthy a, a book or a writings can be called excerpt he was lucky to have a helping brother it was his brother ajit who identified the cricketer in him sachin had a humble beginning he started playing cricket with his colony friends in bandra bandra is his place at the age of 11 his brother took him to ajrekar sir a leading coach in mumbai though at first he couldn't impress him very soon ajrekar sir identified a promising talent in sachin and started training him okay yes i think this part is very clear to all of you don't forget to right copy the main ideas now see when they reached home ajit told his father about how sachin got admission to the summer camp he explained everything please narrate it in ajit's words you simply say it verbally whenever you get time you can write it now what about our coach let us uh, know something about him see this these are the hints which is help you have to uh, prepare a profile of demakan ajrekar sir with this information okay now you know how to write a profile write the name of the person first and you can transform all these sentences all these hints to sentences right just like uh ramakand ajrek the world famous coach uh, of and uh, the the such work sachin coach sachin tendulkar coach was born here is only a year is the that's why in 1932 in malwa maharashtra he was a cricket coach we uh, mentioned that that's why no need of repeating it he was the founder of kamat memorial cricket club at shivaji park some of the famous players trained by him are sachin tendulkar vinod kambli and ajit agarkar he was awarded the dronacharya award in 1990 and the padma shri 
in 2030 you can write it yourself because you have been doing it for many years now yes see there is the uh, uh, some uh, piece of information about uh, Sachin you know it is given at the end of that uh, lesson and something we can get by reading the lesson okay so you try to prepare a profile of Sachin Tendulkar okay hope you have learned what we discussed thank you for watching notes and explanations are there you can uh, download it okay see you bye